So I moved the best Elliot. It's really the only the one I tried, but I uh, wound up separating into another uh, with three main branches, which actually looks like it stretched a little bit since planting. Not much, but almost looks like it did. Actually, this one might have a little as well. Uh, these definitely <laughs> have any new growth, but um, actually, I think one of them. That looks like maybe two of them have lost some leaves. Um, but yeah, I put these three new ones in. And I don't know what I'm going to put. I kind of want to put something in between here. I decided to put the gooseberry in between here for now. Um, and then I'll see about maybe going, as the slope goes down a little bit, maybe planting a little more out that way. Seeking probably the gooseberries because the wild ones seem to naturally sustain at least. Um, but yeah, and then here's the other one. I'll put a little more border in. I might come out a little further as well uh, to build this. Um, right but there were stretch, so that did grow. And then I put the aurora that was dying by the Elliots over here just to see what it'll do. And I'm debating. Well, I'm thinking I should probably pull out some of the horseradish um, that's dying back. I probably don't need as much, or at least trim that, keep that trimmed um, better. It might come over a little more, but most likely I'm going to let the asparagus grow, so I'll allow for the asparagus to expand and maybe come out a little further in the front because I can come out a little bit because I made like a little dip going back. I don't really need the aesthetic. Then coming down further, this is uh, the figs, and um, see how though they wind up doing a little petunia in there. But um, they did they did fruit before I got them. It does appear I look blast. At least I thought I saw a little bit of. Uh, maybe it's not. I thought I saw. looked like it might actually survive and then a couple of the main leaves on that one seem to uh maybe not seem to be surviving seem to not be curling up so i don't know um this one not so much Yeah, this one with the tips. And that was the one that was a branch, so there's no roots on that one. I don't know, maybe there is a little bit of like growth, not much. That up here doesn't look so hot. That looks pretty beat up. I don't it might be a little bit trying to come back. I think it might still be there. So maybe we'll see. Down there. There's down more on this one. Hmm. And this one, this one had some root on it. Maybe it's one of the. Oh, that's probably not it. Don't get anything. Let's see, we'll scan now. And we'll do browncing. Maybe a little bit right there. Down the section. Back a little later. I think I burn these two inside, but for now I'll leave out because I think I know them all. It's probably the middle of November, I'm thinking, before the yeah. killing frost. But we'll see. I think I'll probably keep mulching, uh, build up the mulch a little more. Um, I don't think I'll prune these, but I'll cover them up somehow if it's not with a blanket. It'd be a blanket, maybe I'll lay some glass on here. I think I do plastic. I just do a sliding glass window, a uh, sliding glass door, patio door, window, or maybe two. Yeah, maybe two. 